If you purchase euros in advance of buying a property, should you also add things like notaries and agency fees to the euros that you're purchasing? I think what he's trying to say is, do you need to think of everything that you, all of the possible expenses and make one transfer or? You don't have to. On the smaller fees that you have to pay, like notaire fees or, or solicitor fees, etc., I'd say that it, you won't see much difference if the market was to move. There's not going to be a huge amount of difference. Um, on the larger sums, there will be a significant difference, and that's when you really want to be hedging your risk. But if you do want to purchase a lump sum of euros in advance that you know you have to pay some fees with as well, in addition to the property purchase, then by all means. But if you wanted to, you can hold pounds on account or euros in account, and you can hold them separately as well. So as and when you need to make those payments, you can do. And we can exchange them on the spot for you or we can buy them in advance for you. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. 